Welcome back if you've seen these before, otherwise welcome. Uh, this is the Algebra 2 practice test, question number 31. This is the first practice test, by the way. They put out a whole bunch since we made this. Um, the question says, which graph represents the inverse of h of x equals negative 3x plus 6? Now the reality is this is function notation, so I'm going to convert it into sort of a slope-intercept form first. Just take that h of x and turn it into y. Now, when I'm talking about the inverse, I'm going to, if you invert something, like if you're riding your bike and everything's going great and all of a sudden your head is suddenly facing down, you're doing that little shift. It's almost like I'm moving the axis over. So what it means is I need to take the x and put it where the y is and the y where the x is. And that's what I'm going to do mathematically here. So I'm going to take this original equation and I'm going to change the x and y locations. And I'm just going to solve for y. So for here, I need to draw my line. Uh, I'm going to try to get y by itself, which is right here. So I need to subtract 6 from both sides. Sorry, I'm drawing over stuff. I'm going to move over to this general area. Uh, the x and the 6 can't be combined because they're not like terms. Then I need to divide by negative 3, make everything look all pretty. Uh, negative 6 divided by negative 3 is 2. And since I don't have any number in front of the x, it's a 1. So it's negative 1 over 3x plus 2. So I just need to go to the find one that crosses the axis or the y-axis at 2. Here's one. Here's one. Nah. Nah. Those are out. So what I'm going to be dealing with is just figuring out which one has the negative slope. So negative goes down from left to right. So here it is. And let's see if it's 1 over 2. Go down 1 over 2. I hit the spot. So my correct answer is C. It's not D, by the way, because this is a positive slope and the answer is supposed to be negative. So good luck.